good. We back. It's RTTV. And if it's your first time here, it definitely won't be your last. Make sure you kill, murder, and smash, smash. that subscribe button. And welcome back to RTTV, where we react to everything. Everything. And we're back with another episode of Andor. And last Andor. episode was a little bit crazy. First of all, we got to give a shout out to the homie Meryl because she took initiative and she got a promotion. That's even correct. though everybody in the office was trying to hate on her and trying to say, no, we're not going to listen to you. Ah, uh, there's no rebellion. Ah, uh, but she was right the whole time. She was right the whole time, and that's why she got a promotion, and that's why all y'all mad. All y'all mad. I'm talking about y'all in the y'all in the empire that works with her. And Moth 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 Mothma was making moves and trying to up the Rebel Alliance. And she was talking to she was talking to one of the guys that had showed up to her party and she found out that they were on the same side. Yep. They're on the same page. It's time to make an alliance, baby. It's time to make the alliance go. And the homie Andor mm. went back to his city. Yep. Dummy. For, <laughs> for his mother to be like, yo, you shouldn't be here. And then he's like, bet, I'm going to get out of here. I want you to come with me. But his mom was like, no, I don't want to leave because I want to be a part of the rebellion. I'm Pretty fighting. much is what she said. She said she's fighting. But Andor goes to a new city just to get arrested anyway for walking to the stove. Man, you can't escape. You can't escape the empire, bro. You can't escape the Treat empire, like and you can't be man. looking. You can't look even the least bit suspicious when it comes to the empire because now they on your ass. They on your ass, and now Andor's in jail for six years mm -hmm. for walking to the stove. Well, yep. six years for walking to the store is some real. Yeah, man, that's wild, that's bro. Six years for walking to the stove, but. Let's not waste any more time and let's get into the next episode. But before we do, just want to let you guys know that if you want to see the full reaction of this show, that it is available on our Patreon. It is. Link in the description down below, patreon.com slash rttv underscore. Now, let's get into this next episode. Season 1, episode 8, Narkina 5. I know, Mar I know Narkina. Narkina. Damn, Narkina! Narkina Medina the 5. Oh, damn. <laughs> they really sent him to jail. That's wild, bro. Oh, this is going to be a release right here. No way. It does. You didn't hear the person? It's a name, whole planet. So this is six years later? So they just skipped six years? No, no, no. It seems like this is where they're going to transport him to jail. Oh, well, I was about to say, believe, I'm like, bro. He's still saying, I'm a tourist. So that yeah. means it's still like, he's still in the process of being locked up. Is that Meryl? No. Nah. <laughs> I'm bugging. <Wow. laughs> yeah, this is definitely not in your going home. Bro. Oh, shit. Yeah, complete opposite, bro. It's like a, you're this going to you're going to jail. Oh, there she is. That's Meryl. One would think you want to leave Ferrix as far behind as possible. One, we wrong. Facts. Mm. She's gonna look at it now. She yeah. probably has the authority too. Nah, she fully has the authority too. Now. She should be upstairs by now. Give him Levin's report. We have time. Oh, today we got time. <laughs> he's in jail, so it ain't like he's going anywhere. He's not to escape or something. Yeah, this shit's like what Tom will obey in Star Wars. Wow. Nah, it's on an island. Oh. They brought him to Rikers. Uh, it looks like it came up from the water. Andor was in the act of transferring the unit to a person we've named Axis. Oh, oh damn. Shit, they, they bought that some dude. Yeah. It's a fraction of the price of lost technology. Sorry, sir. Nah, I'm talking about shit. Find this thief. And then what? Identify Axis. He's not there, though. <laughs> yeah. The first Best lead we've had. The fact that y'all already have him. Y'all already have him. <laughs> That's the funny thing about it. Exactly what I want to do, sir. Drill down, find Andor, and get a hunt started. 
they're about to fuck Ferrix. He's gone, bro. They're about to fuck Ferrix. Just funny they gonna hate him on Ferrix, bro. Yeah, nah, facts, cause for how crazy, but nah, yeah, that's true. Nah, they're about to catch bodies on Ferrix. I thought he was stepping on his foot. I'm yeah. like, damn, bro. Stomping everybody up. Imagine that's how you enter jail. Oh, mm, that's this, is mm. <laughs> this is crazy. They got Reebok pumps. <laughs> they do that Reebok pumps. How could one you on the gap most very often Oh, shit. That looked like a different level of pain. I have never seen somebody's right. body contort like that. That looked like some exercise. Bro. Like, I ain't supposed to be here, bro. Yeah. I, I got arrested. I was going to the store to buy milk. To go back home with my shorty. This is his life, Cash. I need more than that. I, Mero, I need more. Just like me. I You're just like me. I wish you luck. We're running late. Give me an opportunity. In order to find a valuable asset going forward. Hire me. Hire me. Hire me. You remember any old five two D requesting you to tow garage? It's crazy because you can't really escape an island, bro. Especially that place. Yeah. <laughs> You have to get a shit. I feel like he's listening too, to like really kind of calculate how he can go about escaping if necessary. It's like everybody's forced to look at me like, God damn, bro, I'm not trying to get into prison like this. My name is Kino Lloyd. I'm the 5 2 Oh, where's he from? He's from, um, he's from Black Panther. He plays Claw. Yep. Oh, okay, word. I'm used to seeing my rooms free on the level. You will want to keep that happening. Sense of you understand. Sick, injured, you talk to me. Problems with another inmate. I'll this is really like a job, and it's like, <laughs> what the fuck? Keep it yourself. Don't ever slow up my mind. Take five. Bro. Boy, say, yo, I got no, less than a year left. Please do not fuck with me right now. Bro. He said, I think I upgraded to a manager. Your boy was working. Bro, I feel bad for this dude, bro. What the fuck are they building? They're building weapons for the Empire to take down the rebellion. Oh. What the f. On the top. And that's five. Ah, right, you gotta get, you gotta do something. That's crazy. They didn't even comp try to compensate for the fact that, like, ah, right, yo, they just had a new person come in. They don't give a fuck, bro. How's that even fair? It's well, what? Not fair my thing, my it's thing not. is like, even, even with Andor, is like, what am I supposed to be doing? And you gotta learn this complicated ass shit, literally right now. Oh wow, now that nasty though. <laughs> I'm not gonna hold you. That's talent. I mean, they've been doing that shit labor. all day, every day. Sweet. Now I've got my taste for it. Disgusting. Yeah, that sounds disgusting. I should find out. Nice to see you again. So he be coming around frequently the way she just said that. Mm -hmm. And she thought it caught on quick. Yeah. Exactly. And that makes me wonder, like, why? She working with the dad, yo. Exactly. Yeah, 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 that's yeah. tough. Crazy, bro. Oh, he's always Unless he's giving signs. No, he's yeah. giving signs to somebody. Yeah, he's somebody talking to somebody. Like, yeah. yeah, come on, bro. I thought he's talking to himself. Nah. nah, see. Yeah, see. Was oh, they got some good ass eyes here to see that shit. Oh, oh shit. Fuels. Don't worry, you learn to eat it. What the fuck? 
Wait, so what what type of food is actually coming out of the tube? Like Damn. He's like stop talking to him. You see a lot of people are heated in there. Like, yo, we really over here suffering the consequences for something that we didn't even do. Yo, shit is crazy. Did that shit. Yeah. He Wait, said, you never heard of it? We be doubling, tripling our days. That's crazy. Imagine somebody's walked in like, yeah. you had three years. Sick. And they got to him. Excuse me, if you will. So nice to meet you. I'm going to spend more time this winter. I promise you. <laughs> <laughs> Ah, oh, he's suspicious. Yeah, he's he got Tay the fuck out of here. That's what he did. Yeah, see, she knows. Yeah, they give him no shoes. Wow. That shit cooled down fast. It's no, no. This is wild. It's heavy, right? They're about to take a shot like a car wash, yo. See, it look like a car wash for humans. This jail is wild, bro. I don't get no soap. This like, jail is wild. Oh, they wait. just spritz up with water. They don't. You, you don't even take a full shower. That shit was they mist. spritz you with Dude, mix, bro. Spray. Yeah, it might be something that has all of it mixed in one. Yeah, yeah, that could yeah, be that. I'm highly advanced. She's a past president. They must have a warm room somewhere. Hey, she's made her wishes clear. Yeah, she's stubborn. She ain't going nowhere, bro. She ain't listen to her son. I told you up front, the struggle will always come first. Yeah, she's a brat. Like, I'm fighting for a cause, bro. Like, fuck our relationship. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> well, that's a good idea. It's been off for a while. It's urgent. What is it like? Is it like a beacon? Yeah, and that's the Empire is gonna get a signal from the beacon, and they're oh, gonna come here. He's shit. A He's an op. Oh, she's about to hit up Homeboy. What's the guy's name? Oh. Yeah, that's not good. She fucked up. She fucked up. Ah, she fucked up. Damn, she fucked up. She fucked up, bro. Aha! Uh -huh. He's found about him. to get got, yeah. And this is exactly what uh, Meryl was looking for. Oh, yeah. More like it's the ISD working for her. Yeah. Mm, yeah, she's, she's right. right. She's right, bro. She's right. Yeah, shut, shut it down. It down don't bro. even ask him. Shut don't even down. ask him. He's not even there. No, you are, bro. There you go. Good decision, bro. Good job. I was actually was afraid that he wasn't going to do it. Yeah, I was about to say, but yeah, you about to make your spot hot right now. Nah, she a good second person to have. Yeah, for sure, bro. She called him on his bullshit. What are you doing? What are you doing? <laughs> ah! Wow. Damn, it's her fault. Yeah. Wow. It is right. That's the place she went yeah, yesterday. Yeah, I'm pretty sure that's the place that she went yesterday. No, she's not okay. He literally, and he literally told her not to do it. Yeah. He literally told her not to do That's it. That's so damn, bro. Bitch, she's is out. Going to jail. Damn. Oh, wow. Nah, she's out, out, bro. She kind of like Jessica Alba. She runs fast in the air. Garrison and old Donnie. Is that you? Hey! Yo, that boy saw Guerrero. Okay, that's all. Mm. He's like, yeah, shit, sure, but you're over here being a little bitch. <laughs> that's what he just said, pretty much. <laughs> He's wow. like, I'll be a bitch. I refused him. And she got back. God damn, bitch. You're going to jail. If she goes to jail, maybe she'll go to the same jail as Andrew. Oh, there's no nah, there's I don't no think there's anyone there. in that jail. Wow. Now. Wow. She played that well. He snitched on her. Uh, she wanted she wanted him to see She wanted her to see him. Yeah. So she could talk. 
Hello, bitch. Hey, but <laughs> say, say <laughs> shit. <laughs> you dare. Oh, Take a seat in the, the torture the chamber. Chair. Assembly begins. See how they did that? It was like they were showing the assembly line, but it was really hinting at the assembly of the rebellion for this next mission right here that Saul's gonna be a part of. Well, he denied him, no? Yeah, he's gonna start doing it. So I don't think so. Not gonna yet. Be a I don't yeah. think not yet. Not yet. So is very like, yo, I'm keeping my head down and I'm not putting myself in this bullshit that you got yourself into because you Black don't even man. have a clear cut. You don't mm -hmm. have a clear cut plan on what you're doing. Like mm -hmm. you don't even know. He even had to ask. Luthen, like, yo, what is your, like, what are you? What are you doing? But he has like, a plan, nah, he though. A Republican. Nah, he, he, he's smart, though, because I feel like you can't just dive your head into um, uh, issues that are, are going on without fully knowing the full scope. So it's good that he's being that precautious. But I just want to just bring up a quick thing, yo. Um, but you feel, really feel like it's a bad deal? It kind of looks nice. Is it a bad deal? <laughs> no, no, no. Like that's why I said earlier, the actual cleansiness is clean. Like yeah, that's clean. one of the cleanest jails I've ever seen in my life. It's just how they go about they it. They got trash it's food, and you crazy. can die. And yo, they don't just beat your ass; they zap the shit out of you. Like they do that to you in real jail. But they don't got exactly. things. They don't that's, got, they don't that's, got that's yards. Worse. They don't got they don't yard time. Yard, they don't have yard time. They don't have. They pretty much work, go to sleep, wake that's up, work it, again. Man. That's all they do. They don't no have food? any free time. The food is and on top of that, if you step out of your cell. You're dead. Like they just kill you. They don't even have an option to put you in a box or some shit like that. Granted, no, they put you in a box. No, nah, I'm, I'm saying. I'm saying. I'm saying when the <laughs> box. Your ass in a box. When, when, when when I'm saying the box, I mean I know, solitary I confinement. But like, yeah, yeah, yeah. they don't really put them in the box. The they don't really. They don't even have that. This no, is I worse. They so. kill you on. They once you step out, this you're dead. Like mm -hmm. <laughs> it's not like the floor is just hot. It's it's in death. That's crazy. Bro. And people yeah. are getting locked up for no reason. Yeah. You, know saying, like, you think people don't get locked up for no reason? Yeah, that's why no, they, they do. No, yeah, they, they, they do. definitely do, but I still, like, jail was never, like, it's surprising that it's like, oh, it's a nice, it's, it's a nice place. I wouldn't categorize jail as that, especially if it's No, not I'm like, saying compared to, like, the uh, Rikers, that Rikers Island. <laughs> but they don't. But they don't even nah, give you, you the option. Go, I, fault, if you had to go to one of those, which one are you going to? I'm going to Rikers. Yeah, I'm going to Rikers. I'm, I don't even want to make that. Decision. I don't want to go to none of them. Yeah. I don't yeah. Yeah. If yeah. I the thing is, but this Rikers. one I think is the last chance that um somebody will take my manhood and stuff like that in like in this jail. <laughs> like I feel like it's way more supervised. Yo, Pat went right there. He said, "Wait, <laughs> where's my body the most protected?" Yeah, I feel like I'm more protected in this jail versus a jail like in uh, Rikers. There is like no soap here. Yeah, I got my sanitation mist. Yeah, sanitation mist. It's the future, so I really think it is. It's, it's Yo, Star Wars. It, it definitely is probably that. No, I really think about it. They were using water things still in Star Wars. They'll kind of be like, "Yo, on a, a high tech thing like that." I feel like that's really the future. So yeah. probably is that's why it is a faster, like quicker way to clean people. But like Andor, um, Andor in his um in his new spot that we saw in the last episode, he had a regular shower. No, nah, no, he's poor. He's poor. someone in jail. But no, he wasn't really he wasn't really poor when he was living in that I, when he was living in the place before he got arrested. I, he like wasn't really that's, poor. Like, that's why I'm trying to say that's yeah, mad. That's mad. Uh, um, mad. Uh, Advanced. Mad people. Okay. So it's like, you know what I'm saying? For them to spend all that, well, I feel like it, they, it'd probably be something in advance where they could just... Yeah, for sure. No, I agree. I agree. Wait, and that's not just what, water mist. Because it's Star Wars. That's what I'm like. I'm like well, I doubt, maybe, maybe they're not even worried about their cleanliness like, like that. But they don't look dirty, <laughs> that's though. That's what I'm saying. They, they don't, don't look even look about how they feed them, bro. But they don't look dirty. And I feel like people, um, you wouldn't want... A, but like. No matter what, you wouldn't want uh, workers to be smelling like this. Like, that's why I really think they have something in advance. Like, you wouldn't want them just banging. Because imagine they was just that mist. They will be smelling. But I think that would be a thing that they will be like, yo, you guys nah, The only reason why I think Robbie's right is just because, like, they put such an emphasis on when dude died. They're like, damn, we're going to have to smell his cork and smell the whole entire night. So I don't really think that they really be knocking like that. And I think that there has to be some type of, some type, something within that mist. I still that you don't think clean. you want to do that. Because that, yeah. that could be the way they clean dogs or something, though. Like, uh, and, you know what yeah. I'm saying? It could be, like, how they clean cows or something. It's, it's a clean, or something but they just use doing it on them. So I feel like, so that's how I feel like it's still, like, they have big showers where everybody just walks in throwing water on you. Which one do you rather? Miss the way it cleans us quick or just bad water, 
Like, I would, I'd rather get the wrist. I don't know, man. I'd rather get some yard time, some real food, and shit like that, bro. They it's don't like get no food. time, bro. They got no time for themselves, bro. Like, in jail, this is a reflection of real jail, too, because obviously, like, there's a lot of jails that basically contract big companies and stuff like that. So the work that they're doing in jail is just literally for other companies that outsource them and shit. But, like... At least with real jail, man, they could actually have some downtime, bro. Over here, bro, they have to work 12 hours just back to yeah, back. There ain't to no back. checkers, ain't no cards, ain't no TV. Nothing, ain't no bro. Nothing. What? I can't freestyle on, like, TikTok. Yeah, you do that, you do that, that dude better come. Hey! You are not working! <laughs> do you want to get fried? They kill you on site. They hit you with the zap thing. That shit's wild. Tasteless. But if, Tasteless. If, you guys are, if you guys are Bix, are you guys trying to reach out to Luthen? Are you guys gonna try to le- reach out to Luthen if y'all? I mean, she already tried. There's no yeah. other contact. No, I'm here. saying when when she did that, like when she Andor's mom is sick. Are you gonna try to leave? Are you gonna try to reach out to Luthen to find out where Andor is? Um, yes. She don't know the. She don't know exactly what went on. She with, doesn't know he did the rebellion yeah. shit. She don't know none of that. If she knew that, maybe it was a. She would know it was a bad idea. But she don't know the extent of what yeah. Andor did. So like, her trying to get a hold of him makes sense. I actually don't um, agree. I don't agree with it. I don't agree with her doing that. What? Because, like, the whole thing is Andor went to Andor went back to the planet, right? And as soon as he got there, everybody's like, yo, you got to dip because you're putting us in danger, right? So, like, especially where the Repu- especially where the Empire is cracking down now, now is not the... And when you're seeing it, because even before, before they showed that, they showed the Empire, like, inside the planet looking through yeah. shit. So it's like, it wouldn't be smart to tell Andor, the same person that's going to get you guys jeopardized and hurt... To try to find him and tell him to come back to the planet. Yeah, I don't. I don't, I don't agree with what matter. she did. I, don't right, I feel like did. basically at that time, considering how out your way you have to go to make that call, I'm assuming that they're trying to tap into every single line because she already knows how much they tightened up on Ferex. So like, if you see Andor and you told him, "Yo, you shouldn't be here because how much they tightened up," then I wouldn't try to make a call that's potentially gonna bring them over here. Because how much they tell you. But this, but this line is secure. This line is like the, the rebellion line. Although they ended up hacking into it anyway. Yeah. But I don't, I don't think... I don't she feel doesn't like, know how deep it goes. Yeah, like, she, she really don't thinks, know. She thinks nah, like this dude murdered two does, people bro. and they all... She no, she don't. Not, 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 not in she terms knows. of she that. Knows. I say... I'm I say, talking as a person that watched this show yeah. and knows the extent of how much they're going to tap well, the line. Well, nah, if that's the case, then I wouldn't do it. Yeah, you know what I'm saying? He asked if I was Bix what I do. And if I'm Bix... Then yes, I would. No, you I'm still not doing it if I'm Bix because here's the thing, right? Not only does she know that the that the Empire is over here looking for Andor and they're coming to the city. She doesn't know the extent of it, but she knows that the Empire is around and they're dangerous and they're looking for Andor. On top of that, when she walked into the when she walked into the establishment, the dude told her, Bix, that's not a good idea. I don't think you should do this. Yeah, because even, like because even, like they're trying to tap it. He even said it was a bad idea. He said we haven't heard from him in a long time. He said you shouldn't go back. He said he said you shouldn't go back there. That's, he told exactly, he, that's he, exactly what he, he said. He said no, word for word, you shouldn't you, you really go should, back you really there. Yeah. Do this. And then she's like, but it's really important. And then he's like, uh, and then even her son, even even his son looked at him like, yeah, his son looked at him. I don't like, think yo, I don't dad, think you should have let him do that. Come right? On, so like you know the extent, you know to an extent that the empire put it like this: the empire is on your ass. At the end of the day, people are. Like, Andor's not supposed to be there for a reason. Like, you told Andor to leave for a reason because you knew that they was on but his ass. But she wasn't calling Andor, she was calling Luthen. To find out where Andor is so he could yeah. come back. Yeah, but so how, he would they know, how would they know that Luthen was connected to Andor? Like, she wouldn't know that... She wouldn't know that there was a connection between Luthen and Andor. I think it's just like because of the, the fact... Room, that the, that the uh, Empire would know. You tell someone Meryl would it? Yeah, like... I think Bix, Meryl, Bix, she Bix, went, Bix wouldn't assume that... The, the Empire would know that Andor is connected to Luthen. But it's not even about them. I mean, he, she would because of the fact that she knows that Luthen was initially picked up by Andor. That's why she even called Luthen to get no, in but, contact with But to, know, to think that the, the Empire would pick up on that, I don't think she would. No. Oh, yeah, that's why I said she's dumb. <laughs> that's what I'm saying. Nah. No, because the thing is, it's like, regardless of anything, right, if you're in that situation, you know how crazy things are on your planet, I would be thinking about everything in that situation. I'll be as paranoid as possible. Because if you're going to that extent to try to contact Andor, that already shows how crazy the situation is. And, and, and on top of that, bro, you already seen Homie. Homie, you're, uh, like the person that owns the shop, Pac, he was like, yo, you shouldn't do this. I, I, I don't know. It's just, and she, and, also, and on top she of also that, doesn't know how deep Luthen is either. Like, yo, she knows Luthen as a dude that just buys stolen goods and shit. Yeah. Like, yeah, she yeah, doesn't, like she yeah, doesn't know him as like, 
This is the goddamn leader of the rebellion. Like, you know what yeah, I'm saying? Yeah, like, sure. she don't know that. So, like, for us, it's like, yo, you call yourself the leader of rebellion to go get this dude. But it's not, even, it's not even just that. Like, it's like, he, he, she doesn't right. know these She doesn't know these things, but at the end of the day, one thing that she does know is that the empire is on everybody's they're ass, to and they're, top, they're tapping into every line. That's why that's a secure... They put it like this. They, they went over there because they detected that somebody was using a secure line from that area. That's the only reason why they went to that place, right? And, and as a result of it, <laughs> as a result of it, think about it. What it seemed like as a result of it, they kidnapped dude, and it seemed like he dropped the bomb and said, yo, bitch knows about Andor. That's what it seemed, and that's why they were like, oh, that's why it seems like, oh, they were like, Bix, oh, this is Bix, we're going after her. At the end of the day, what drove them there was the thing that told the dude that the dude told Bix not to do it anyway because it was a secure line. So because if there was but a secure line on go that, there. Because of they originally went to get, Cyril, to get Andor. Because of what? No, no, I'm yeah, saying no. They're actually, already on the planet because of the information yeah. that 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 Car that Karn said, right? Yeah. Now the reason why they went to the shop was because somebody they was found like, out well, somebody yeah. was. That's the only reason why they went to get packs. That's packed. the only reason why. Yeah, that's the only reason why they went to get packs, and that's the reason why Pax told Bix, "Yo." I don't think this is a good idea. And that's why yeah. they even found Bix because he snitched on her. Yeah. It was like Bix cut in. Ah, uh, yeah, bring that ass over here, yo. Homie just snitched on you this morning. Yeah, and that's why <laughs> I feel like um the biggest issue we just ran into in this episode started is what we said is what I uh, said last episode, yo. Once those two people come together, Karn and um Meryl, mm -hmm. it's fucked. Because like now he's the one who put the battery in her back about Ferrix. Yeah. He was the one that was like, yo, he was on Ferrix, bro. You gotta get him in Ferrix. This all, yo, everything that's happening on Ferrix is not what it seems to be. It's something way bigger than that. So she went personally to yeah, Ferrix. Exactly, like yeah, exactly. Like, she heard that shit got used. Like, because I feel like if that shit would have got used and it was just them there, it wouldn't have been that serious. Mm -hmm. It's because she was tapped in and she was like, oh, they used the phone there? Nah, I'm going to Ferrix. Yep. And then that's when she started doing it. Because all that extra shit, like, technically, like, Bix couldn't have known how deep this shit is. Like she couldn't have known. Yeah. Like no, because she, because honestly, I agree. I agree. because honestly, all the other all the shit you're talking about, like all these things would never have happened if she just used the phone. It's because Karn told called Meryl and Meryl because of all the shit that's going on. That's what it all led to. So I feel like she just didn't. She didn't think it all the way through. Don't get me wrong. When she seen that's Pax, what I'm saying. She, she didn't think it all the way through. When like, she, she seen like, when she seen when she Pax, like, yo, I know she was like. Fuck. Like, yeah. damn, I really played homie. But at the end of the day, she never, I don't think she thought it would get that But, like, my, my thing is, like, if Pax is telling you, if Pax is looking at you and saying, Don't use it. Don't use it. Like, there's a reason why we're not using it. Don't use it. To the extent, I gotta be like, I gotta be like, yo. Yeah, that's the thing. It was a desperation. And, 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 she doesn't yeah. know how deep it is, but she still knows, yo, these motherfuckers are after Andor. It's so funny. And you know how many times Andor done got away? <laughs> like she's like, yeah. yo, I can get him. Yeah, but the last time, away. but the last time she came, he, the last time he came, he told her, he's like, yo, you need to leave and not come back. But we know Andor. Andor said I'm gonna come back. He said when he left, he was like, I'll be back. He was gonna come back regardless. I would think to see his his mom's eventually. It's funny that um, their their empire is undoing is actually things that they are doing. Like the the reason they can't find Andor is because they. Crack down on, on yeah. everybody else and fucking lock them up under another alias. So yeah. that's the only reason why they're not gonna be able to find him, even through the information they get through, uh, they get from Bix. Yeah, it was just funny, mm -hmm. and it's it's ill too because um this dude yo Luthus is some wild shit. He was like he basically wants to do this mission with Saw and that other individual because. He wants the the mission to be successful to the point that the Empire can tra uh, basically crack down and cause more oppression because more oppression will make more people rise up. Rebellion. That shit's crazy to me and shit. So like I'm 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 really I really think that um so after thinking this through more, I think we're gonna see him within this last arc of this show be a part of this mission that Luther like invite him to do and stuff. He might be hesitant now, but I feel like Luther's gonna say the right, you know, rhetoric in order to get him aligned with that shit, bro. I think it just has to affect him. Yeah, I think, exactly. I think that's what Luther's gonna do. Luther's gonna make it where it affects him. Because mm -hmm. basically all he really said was like, bro, this ain't my fight, bro. Like, I'm not getting my people smoked out. Like, for homie? No. Nope. I'm it's the people it. itself, though, because he named all this... He, he said like, was like eight, eight different eight, eight, vocabulary eight, words, yo. Yeah. He named like different. Um, I feel like beliefs and shit like that. Structures. I, think, I thought it was rebel. Um, rebel factions. Or yeah, rebel yeah. factions that all got smoked. 
He's like, I'm not gonna, was, oh, he's not gonna be like that. Yeah, I thought that's that's how I took it. He named all these other factions that were also rebels. That yeah. yo, they all got smoked. I'm not about to be the next yeah, one. We're gonna yeah. be different. I, yeah, I took that from mm-hmm. that. And he was like, my people's good. Yeah, like, my people's good. Like I'm not sending my people to die yeah, we're not for what? Like that. Yeah. For yeah, your fight? Like for what you? You want me to go help you? I'm no, not, I'm not killing my dude for that. So I feel like it has to affect it. It has to be on some shit. Like Luther gets it where it's like. All right, now they fuck my shit up. Yeah. All right, now let's go. I think he's gonna. I think he's gonna. Yeah, something's gonna happen to where, kind of like what's happening in the Andor, but probably on a smaller scale, where something's gonna happen and personally was gonna be like, all right, now nah, I'm joining the fight because we're seeing why Andor is eventually gonna join this fight. Like he's locked up. The prisoners are getting treating, aren't getting treated fairly. He got locked up on for walking to the store, which is still the craziest shit. But like, it's getting crazy. Well, I'm kind of interested how he feels about it because. You seen how stressed he was when he realized it's his fault. Like for a lot of the shit that's going on in his jail, mm-hmm. cause like th- at one point they were like, "Yo, we had a we had a date. Like we know how many days until we get out." Now these dudes are like, ever since the rebellion, they coming down here and like just up in our days, three years, six years. And he's like, "What happened with the rebellion? Why are they doing this to us?" And Andor knows all the answers, but he can't tell them. Yeah, he's like, like, "I, I did it." I like so the same way that you were just saying right now, how he was like, um. I think it was Pat was like, yo, we gotta cause more up like up highs and so it fucks up more people so they join the rebellion. I feel like Andor seeing that, like, damn, you fucking the people up so that they join the rebellion. Cause mm-hmm. these people are, are the ones who are really dealing with the re- yeah. repercussions of what we've done. Mm-hmm. And even the people on Ferrix, Ferrix gotta live a completely different life because all this shit. So it's like, I don't know. How's he gonna feel about it? I mean, we know how he's eventually gonna feel about it, yeah. but how does he get there? Yeah. Well, we're gonna see what happens moving on in the Next episode of Andor. It looks like this is gonna be the, this is the last episode of the second to last arc. Yep. So the next arc is gonna be the last arc. So it's getting interesting, and I'm curious to see, I'm curious to see what's gonna happen next episode. That's when the craziness starts to happen. Right. I think a lot of people gonna get got, but thank you guys for watching. If it's your first time here, it definitely won't be a last. Make sure you kill, murder, and smash, smash that subscribe button. I'm the man, the myth, the maniac. Wilkins underscore RT. What up, it's your boy DC. It's your boy Up City RT. It's your boy Wells, the anime king. Patrick Gaultier. And that settles it at the, the round, round table. table.